Okay, I wanted to do a quick video on um, two more Synergy 12 stones. Um, I recently acquired a piece of Moldavite, and this little piece of Moldavite, green Moldavite, doesn't look too pretty, but it does what they say it does. Um, before it ever became a Synergy 12 stone, um, Moldavite was highly sought after because it's really a high ascension stone. Um, it allows for really quick, high frequency evolution. Um, it activates your higher chakras. It offers protection and cleansing. Um, but it really offers a rapid transformation and it just blasts open, you know, your crown chakra. It's just like pew! I, I, it's almost too much to handle if you're not really um, advanced at meditating with a stone like this. I did not meditate with it for very long. Um, I just tried it out just to see and I'm usually pretty dense when it comes to these kinds of things. Um, I don't pick up things really easily. I think I told you about my experience with the Azestolite which is also supposed to be um, a pretty huge mind blower. I got little effects from it. I did get effects, but little. I can say this one was pretty powerful and I'll have to meditate with it some more and for a longer period of time to really get from it the full effect. Um, honestly, I didn't want to go too long with it because again, I keep saying it, but I really feel it. I'm not a super experienced meditator. I've only just recently gotten good at it and quieting my mind um, and doing it regularly and consistently. When I say recently, like within the last six months. So I want to go at things like this very slowly. But Moldavite is a piece of a glass, meteoritic glass, similar to Tektite. If you watch the other Synergy 12 video, it's a type of Tektite, but it's a specific kind, um, comes from a specific area in Czechoslovakia where there was a meteorite that crashed, hit the earth. And um, there's pieces of this strewn around. So they pretty much made the um, very good assumption that this is where the um, Moldavite came from. It's found nowhere else in the world. And it's the only tektite that's green this way. And so... terrestrial connection with using Moldavite, this stone. Um, some authors make a huge deal and have written whole books just about Moldavite. So very um, powerful piece right there and uh, very emotionally moving for a lot of people. Okay, this is Scolocyte. And I have quite a few pieces like this um, that are just basically um, fibers of it. And I think I'll probably be selling these as like sets of three or something like that. Um, Autumn, Autumn's Magic had a video where she had acquired a lot of stones and she, I think she had a pretty big piece of Scolocyte. Scolocyte's not easy to get um, and neither is Moldavite. Well, Moldavite is, but it's just really expensive because it's so rare. So a little piece like that will be kind of on the high side. So Scolocyte is kind of opposite from Moldavite. Being a Synergy 12 stone, it does do the um, higher ascension thing, but it does it on a more quiet level. It's more of a peaceful stone, whereas this one just blasts you right out of your crown chakra. This does it in a much more gentle way. We'll accomplish the same thing, but at a slower pace and in a more gentle way. It's more about tranquility um, and really about peace. 
and awakening your heart. Um, it also allows for um, interdimensional travel, so traveling back and forth within dimensions. Okay, I just wanted to make this one a quick short one. Crystal blessings.